a thrilling 13 year old tour of Saturn, the ring the planet came to close on 15 September 2017 as NASA's Cassini spacecraft made its final plunge into the atmosphere of Saturn. This was the final chapter of an amazing mission which began in 1997, but it is also a new beginning. Nicholas Altobelli, Cassini's project scientist said, Cassini has made a wealth of discoveries. We will have to rewrite many textbooks on planetary science. Read on to know the journey of Cassini. Sri Kala was thinking back to the time the story of the Cassini space mission. Cassini was almost a billion miles away from the earth. Sri Kala like the rest of the world had been thrilled at the distance over which the event was taking place. This was the first time such a thing had happened and it was called the day the earth smiled. Now we can see the earth the arrow mark showing earth and moon from Saturn. The image that Cassini clicked is spanned about 651591 kilometers and contains the entire Saturn system with the earth and the moon in the background. Saturn the sixth planet from the sun with a dense system of rings around it is the second largest planet and is visible to the naked eye. Now we can see the miracle that happened many centuries later the Saturn Jupiter conjunction on December 21st 2020. Cassini Huygens 1997 to 2017 Cassini Huygens space journey began on 15 October 1997 Cassini was an unmanned spacecraft launched to study Saturn its rings and its moons weighing its tons and as tall as two story house it was one of the largest heaviest and most complex interplanetary spacecraft ever built it was named after the 17th century astronomers Giovanni Cassini and Christian Huygens NASA along with the European Space Agency and the Italian Space Agency came together to build this spaceship. Cassini reached Saturn on 1 July 2004. It would spend 13 years orbiting Saturn, the longest any spacecraft has orbited any of the outer planets. Now we can see the launching of Cassini Huygens. 9 8 7 6 5 4 3 2 1 and lift off of the Cassini spacecraft on a billion mile trek to Saturn. Pitch program is in, roll program is in. We have cleared the tower and the Cassini spacecraft is on its way to Saturn. T plus 20 seconds, all systems are go. Cassini Huygens its design and mission Cassini Huygens design included two parts a Saturn orbiter called Cassini which continually orbited Saturn and sent back pictures and a lander called Huygens Huygens separated from the spacecraft and landed on Saturn's moon Titan this was the first ever landing by a man-made spacecraft in the outer solar system the Cassini spacecraft landed near Saturn in July 2004 after a seven year journey Proud to be the first man-made object, Cassini began to orbit Saturn, the sixth planet in the solar system. Over the next few months, Huygens landed the spacecraft by a parachute on Saturn's largest moon Titan. Now we can see how Huygens lander landing on Titan. Cassini's understanding of the 62 moons orbiting Saturn, six of which were discovered by Cassini, additional information about the mysterious rings around it and information about methane rivers and lakes above the main moon Titan has astonished the scientific world. This will help to increase our understanding of Saturn. Why was Cassini special? One of mankind's quests has been the search for other planets that support life. In Enceladus One of the Saturn's moon the possibility of an ocean of water beneath the ice surface is considered important in Cassini's discoveries the water and carbon dioxide here are thought to have an environment in which the organism can live 
Scientists believe that Enceladus is one of the most likely places in the solar system where alien microbial life may be found. This may enhance our understanding of life and the different forms it can take. Cassini's data on Saturn's largest moon, the orange-colored Titan, has many parallels to the Earth, with lakes, rivers, channels, dunes, rain, clouds, mountains, and possibly volcanoes. This is similar to the condition of primordial Earth and can increase our understanding of how life evolved. Now, observe the video, what are the things happening in Earth, all the things happen in Titan also. This shows Titan is like a primordial Earth. Now we can see the lander Hygens is landing on Titan. We can see the shadow of objects in Earth. Likewise, we can see the shadow in Titan also. Now we are seeing the shadow of the parachute of the lander. In Earth we can see the lamp spot. Likewise in Titan also we are able to see the lamp spot of the lander. We can also see the dew drop falling down. From Earth, we are able to see the Sun. Likewise, from Titan also, we are able to see the Sun. Cassini also gave various information about the rings around Saturn, which are considered to be the symbol of the planet. It has been revealed that these rings are located in the millions rather than in the thousands. Made of ice and rock particles, the rings are thought to be debris from comets, asteroids, or shattered moons. On 25th October 2012, Cassini witnessed the great white spot on Saturn, a massive storm that occurs roughly every 30 years. The storm was the first of its kind to be observed by a spacecraft in orbit around Saturn. Now we can see the white spot in Saturn sent by Cassini spacecraft in this video. Saturn is also the windiest planet with atmospheric winds up to 1600 km per hour. Now we can hear sound of wind sent by Cassini spacecraft. Cassini also took many stunning pictures of the Earth, the Moon, Jupiter, Saturn and its moons. In its achievements, Cassini far exceeded its expectations. No other spacecraft in history had come to know a planetary system as closely as Cassini knew Saturn. The Grand Finale The Grand Finale, as the final journey of Cassini was called, took place on 15 September 2017. Cassini moved out of the orbit of Saturn and plunged into its atmosphere at a speed of 75,000 meters per hour, like a shooting star streaking across Saturn's sky. The destruction of Cassini was an intentional move made to avoid the risk of contaminating a moon that could be lived in. The spacecraft made detailed maps of Saturn's gravity and magnetic fields, revealing how the planet was arranged internally and possibly helped in solving the mystery of just how fast Saturn rotates. Its cameras also took amazing close-up images of Saturn's rings and clouds. Cassini collected data for 13 years and was instrumental in fostering international scientific cooperation. Now we can see in this video how Cassini moved out of the orbit of Saturn and plunged into its atmosphere like a shooting star.
Rasni has made countless discoveries. It may take many years to complete the study. In a sense, the Cassini spacecraft is the beginning of a great discovery. Seen in that sense, Cassini is not saying goodbye. It is the seed in space. Thank you.